Okay, the seatbelt noise is actually coming from this. Inside here, there's a little washer that is actually making a noise. Now, if you listen closely, you'll hear it. Right. That's the noise. If you can hear that clicking. Okay, I'm going to show you what is making that noise. Alright, to get this Torx nut open, it's a T47. And this is what's inside there. You can see there's the the uh, little washer there and that's what's making that noise as it moves inside there on the other side there's the spacer and then this also a type of washer so what i'm going to do is i'm going to sort out this this washer i think it's gotten a bit uh tired it's got a it's, it's like a spring washer it's supposed to offer a little bit of lateral spring and I think it's done here's a close-up view you can see what it looks like that's it okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and bend this like it's almost like a shim it's very thin I'm just gonna use some pliers and I'm just gonna bend this give it a bit more curvature uh, it's more like an interim solution till I can go and find a, a shim like this now as you can see I've bent it a bit now I'm gonna put it back on here there we go and that should provide more tension and stop that rattle or that clicking sound but Obviously the best bet would be to go and get a new one because what will happen is after some time This this one is actually tired. It will go to form it will f form back into in its original position and That rattle will come back. So that's the part you need to change now. I'm just going to reassemble the door the um, seat belt Okay to put it back put this the nut through the bolt through the uh, spacer and then there's this uh, other washer and now we're just going to screw it back into the side of the the car okay the important thing to notice is that it doesn't you can make this very tight but it won't make this part tight because the spacer hits onto a platform so obviously you've got to make the seat belt the stalk um, bolt tight here but then what happens is uh, this will still have some free play in order to move but now what you can notice and if you can hear it I'm gonna get really close let's see that clicking is gone so the noise originates from this tired spacer or kind of a washer a spring washer that is uh, over time lost its uh, springiness and I've just uh, manually changed it but obviously what you would need to do is replace that washer because this one is tired and now we just put everything back together the way it took it off to get to this point uh, you would have had to pull off these seals front and on the back on the back door there then there's a plastic clip here i uh, pulled that off just pull it off with the screwdriver there's no screws on it at all and then you will find that one two are the these are push pins and this one over here you actually just pull off because you'll see there are two clips there one and two just be careful you don't drop that clip down below because it's quite a mission to get that back so in reassembling I just push these push pins back in 
and then push push this panel put the cover back on and then reseal seat these seals and that's it that's how i got to this point and i've shown you how to reassemble it thanks for watching